Hi, I'm Aideen and welcome to Playful Pathways. Today I want to talk about how you can build a stronger relationship and bond with your child. The best way to do this is to step into your child's world and speak the language that your child knows best which is play. Now, as a parent, it's really easy to get caught in all that business of parenting. There's all the organizing and the feeding and cleaning and keeping them alive. And it's really easy to overlook time spent just being with your kids and listening to them and talking to them, and playing with them. The thing is, all of those moments, those little moments, they add up to what will be the foundations of your relationship with your child. Now, and into the future. Because the thing that parents don't realize often is that you are your child's favorite person, hands down. Your gaze, your attention is like the warmth of the sun to your child. They not only crave it and want it all the time, they actually need it. The quality of the attention that you pay to your child teaches them about themselves and teaches them about the world around them and their place in the world. So when you spend time listening to your child and wanting to understand their thoughts and feelings and understanding the world from their perspective, you teach them, I'm loved. I'm interesting, I'm fun to be around, the world cares about my thoughts and feelings and I have something to contribute to the world. Now that all might sound a little bit heavy and serious teaching my child about their place in the universe, but actually they're already learning all of that stuff every time they play, they're learning those things. You don't have to do any special games or activities with them for them to get these messages, you just have to join them in their play at whatever age or stage they're at. Uh, if you have a baby, that might involve singing nursery rhymes, uh, playing imitation games where you imitate faces and sounds and actions, um, could be playing peekaboo, things like that. If you have a three or a four year old, you might be playing with cars or dolls or figurines. You might be singing or dancing or playing hide and seek. Now, if you've got primary school aged kids, you might be doing things like playing uh, dress ups and role play. You might be playing board games with them or you might be making and building things or, or even telling stories. And when your children get older again, you might like to do things like uh, playing sports together, learning something together, cooking, uh, doing art. Ultimately, it doesn't matter what you play with your kids, just so long as you play something with them. Let them tell you and show you what they're interested in and your job is to step into that world and join them at whatever stage they're at. And while that's happening, while these lovely playful moments are happening, they'll be getting all of that important stuff and you will be learning about your child as they grow you will be learning about what their strengths and their interests are and you'll be able to become more sensitive and aware of what their troubles are and what's worrying them or things that they're struggling with. They'll be able to share all of this with you much, much more easily and you'll be able to pick it up much more easily because you're listening and because you're showing them that you want to know them and want to understand them. And hopefully you'll also be having loads of fun. That's all from me. If you like these videos, hit subscribe. And if you want to find out more about the Playful Pathways community, have a look at my Patreon page. Or if you're a parent who wants to know how you can introduce play more regularly into your relationship with your child, have a look at my video, the 10 minute tune in. In that video, I'm going to show you how bringing in just a little bit of focused play every day is really going to deepen your relationship with your child. Thank you for watching and hopefully see you again soon. Bye.